اعوذباللہمنشیطوانرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ورحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹ ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو اسٹارٹ اوور میتھ کلیسن آف کلاس تھری اینڈ فار دس پرپز یو ہیو ٹو اوپن یور کاؤن ڈاؤن بکس پیج نمبر فورٹی سکس بفور اسٹارٹنگ یو ہیو ٹو ڈسائڈ دعا بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ربی ضدنی علما ربی ضدنی علما ربی ضدنی علما Dear students, on your countdown book, page number 46, we are going to start our topic of subtraction of four-digit numbers. Dear students, to subtract two four-digit numbers, we follow the same method as we did with two or three-digit numbers. But you have to remember that you always start from the right. Whenever you start subtraction, you have to subtract the member numbers in the ones column first, then tens, hundreds. and thousands in the in the end first of all subtraction without regrouping for this purpose here is an example on your countdown book page number 46 here is the example of four digit number you have to follow the four step in the first step you have to subtract the ones column you have to subtract nine ones minus 2 ones equal to 7 ones then in the step 2 you have to subtract the tens column subtract the tens 6 tens minus 4 tens equal to 2 tens when you subtract 4 from 6 uh, you have uh, um, answer 2 in the third step you have to subtract the hundreds column subtract the hundreds 4 hundreds minus 0 hundreds you have answer 400 always remember that when you subtract zero from any digit there is uh, you have answer the same digit now step number 4 you have to subtract the thousand column subtract the thousands 2000 minus 1000 equal to 1000 this is the subtraction without regrouping now come toward the page number 47 on page number 47 Here is the subtraction with regrouping, converting tens into ones. Here is an example of four-digit number. You have to follow the four step. In the first step, you have to uh, subtract the ones column. Eight cannot be subtracted from one, as you see that eight cannot be subtract subtracted from the one because one is a smaller number and eight is a bigger number. So convert one tens into ten ones. 10 plus 1 equal to 11 ones. So you have take the carry from tens column, and you have to take one from the tens column. And here uh, we made 11. So 11 ones minus 8 ones equal to 3 ones. Okay. In the step two, you have to subtract the tens column. As you take one from the tens column, so here four uh, is remaining. So you have to subtract two from Four. Now subtract the remaining tens. Four tens minus two tens equal to two tens. Now in step three you have to subtract the hundreds column. Four hundred minus three hundred equal to one hundred. And in step four you have to subtract the thousand. Three thousand minus one thousand equal to two thousand. Now student, here is another example. Subtraction with regrouping, converting hundreds into tens. Now here is an example of four-digit number. you have to follow the four step in the first step you have to convert 1 10 into 10 ones and subtract as you know that in the ones column we can't subtract 5 from 1 so we have to take the carry from the tens column and we made here 11 so when we subtract 5 from 11 the answer will be 6 now in the step 2 you have to convert 100 into 10 tens plus 4 tens so when we carry the uh, when we take the uh, one from this column here is remaining 4 now we can't subtract 7 from 4 so we take the carry uh, from the hundreds column we take the uh, one digit from the hundred columns so here we made 14 we have to subtract 7 from 14 so convert 100 into 10 ones plus 4 tens so 14 tens minus 7 tens equal to 7 tens so we have to uh, ha we have the answer 7 here in the uh, under the tens column now in the step 3 you have to 
solve the hundred column as you uh, take one uh, one from this uh, as you take the one carry in the tens column so uh, here is remaining three so you have to subtract one from the three when you subtract one from the three the answer will be two now in the fourth step you have to uh, solve the thousand column you have to subtract one from the three and the answer will be two i hope you have to understand the concept of subtraction with without regrouping and with regrouping so uh, you have to uh, practice these questions on your notebooks also stay blessed allah hafiz fi amanillah